Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I am Madeline Finken and I create lifestyle and vlog videos so I'd love if you would subscribe below or in the icon over here. Um, today I wanted to film a pack with me video and I want it to be like super chill and not like some of my other videos so I thought I would just take you guys along with me as I'm packing for Colorado. I'm leaving later today. So I'm just kind of filming this video as I was packing. So I decided on everything that I'm going to take and I thought I would just give you guys a little bit of insight. Maybe it would help you if you were packing for a ski trip or maybe it won't, but I thought you guys would maybe enjoy. So let's go on and get into the video. So the first thing that I am packing is my ski clothes. Um, the things that I do not have right now are I need to find my helmet my goggles and my gloves but I recently got um, some new ski clothes so I thought I would show you guys I got these uh, white pants I usually have black pants and a black jacket and I wanted to like change it up a little bit and not be like in all black so I went out and bought some new clothes and so these are just like um, a slim fitting pant um, they're just white nothing really special um, I just like how they fit and they're not like super baggy on me. And then this morning I discovered that my ski jacket that I usually wear um, was a little bit too small on the arms as I've had it for a really long time. So it was a little bit late to go buy a ski jacket and we didn't really have any extras at my house. So I just went to the mall and I went to Macy's and I ended up finding something and they were all like 50% off or it might have been 60. Yeah, it was 60% off. So I got this cute, super cute coat. I'm really into like the faux fur and I really wanted a fur hood because my mom's ski jacket has a fur hood and I really wanted red but they didn't really have like a lot of color choices and it wasn't really time for me to be picky about it if I wanted a new ski jacket. So I got this jacket, if you can kind of see. Um, it's just like this cute blue like turquoise color and has a super cute hood. I thought it would, it has like inside um, insulation and then it also has like the really puffiness and I got a size medium um, so that I could wear like clothes underneath it so that I would not be cold. And this was like originally $250 and I got it for like, I think a hundred or something like that. So it was a really good deal and I can wear it for a long time. And then um, boots wise, I have... I've had these boots for like a long time. They're just like a tote boot. Um, they're really comfy and I literally just wear them like whenever I'm going to get my ski rentals and stuff like that. So that I have something to wear that my feet don't get super wet. And yesterday I actually invested in another pair of Uggs. I have the gray one and I got the black ones and these now come waterproof. So I sprayed them with like the suede spray but I thought I would take these too because these are really nice to wear just with like jeans to dinner because I don't really have a lot of booties that can get wet so these are nice that these can get wet and like they're they won't get ruined so the next pair of shoes that I'm gonna bring um are actually I need to find them they are my adidas swift fleas so they're just a pair of tennis shoes I don't know if I'll need tennis shoes but I thought I might as well bring them just in case I do and then the other shoes that I'm taking are my Vince Camuto um black slip-ons and I wear these all the time they're the ones I wore in my most recent vlog on New Year's Eve and I really like those and then clothing wise I literally just brought like some pajamas like shorts and pants and then ski wear clothes I brought um, a white scarf just in case it's like kind of cold um, this like it's just a hoodie it's like a Calvin Klein sweatshirt um, it's really nice because it doesn't zip so I can just put it on over what I'm wearing like long sleeve wise and wear this in the coat and I should be warm enough and then um, I have one of these like ski guards I don't know if I'm really gonna need it but it goes like right here so if it is snowing or it's like really windy out um, it'll protect my face from getting windburn and then my mom and sister like to wear like the thermal shirts, but I get really hot in those, especially whenever the sun's out. So I just like to wear these Lululemon like Swiftly Tech shirts. So I think that I have another one or two of these at school, but I didn't bring them home because we were not planning on going skiing. So I only had this one and then I had this gray one, but it doesn't matter because like no one's going to see it. And I think... We're gonna either ski two or three days so I can wear one of them again if I need to. And then 
Leggings wise, I'm wearing to the airport the same fast and free green leggings that I was wearing in my other vlog and so I'm gonna wear those for skiing. Um, I also brought these Lululemon ones. They're like um, ombre maroon color. I don't know if you really can tell, kind of. And so I'll take those and then of course just like a black pair of Lululemon ones. These ones are kind of cottony and these are like the blue on material so they're really stretchy and like spandexy. So if it's really cold out, then I'll probably opt for the black ones just because they'll be warmer. And then I just brought like just one pair of Lulu shorts because it's gonna be pretty cold. So like I'm not really gonna wear them, but I thought maybe I'd wanna wear them around the hotel room or something like that if I didn't wanna wear pajamas. And then I packed um, three t-shirts. We're leaving on Wednesday and we'll be back Sunday. So I don't really need a lot of t-shirts, um, but I just brought like three as you can see two of them are the same color and then of course the one I'm wearing I'll have so I just didn't feel like I needed to like overpack on t-shirts because in the reality I wasn't really gonna wear them so the next thing I have is like my clothes that I'll wear like to dinner or if we have somewhere to go so I'm just wearing I'm just bringing this turtleneck white sweater um, it's from forever 21 I wore it um, to a game day earlier this season and it's really warm, really nice. It fits well under my um, denim jacket, my black denim jacket. So like that's nice because I can wear that. And then I got this really cool fur coat um, from Shein. And so I'm going to take it with me and hopefully I'll wear it. I think it's so cute though. Like these are very in right now. And I think it was like $40 or something like that. So it was not super expensive. But I thought it'd be cute with like black jeans and a black um, top underneath and so I thought that would be cute. And then I always like to take some type of cardigan with me just so that I don't get super cold. If I don't want to wear like a big puffy jacket then I don't have to or if I wear something out to dinner and need like like kind of a cuter I guess like cardigan to go with it instead of wearing like a huge jacket and we're not going super far. I have this one from Target and I love it. I've literally had it forever and it's just like a great piece to take and then this is just that black shirt and i really love my free people jeans i have these in white black and green so i'm taking those and i'm taking this jean jacket it's actually from amazon um it was like 25 dollars, and it's like one of my favorite things that i own and then i'm taking this shirt it's from this girl in my sorority that uh, sells clothes and it looks like it's really cropped and like little but if you tie this like around your body and you wear a jacket over it it's not nearly as revealing as it looks right there and then I recently got this distressed sweater from the brand Fate and you can kind of tell on camera it's kind of hard to tell um, but it has some ripping and that would be really cute with those green jeans so that's why I brought that it's a little cold though because I don't have a black tank top and I'm gonna have to wear, I guess, I don't know what I'm gonna wear underneath it yet. And then I thought about bringing my black free people jeans but I wear those all the time and I love these jeans too. Um, these are my American Eagle jeans. I've literally had these since like sophomore year of high school and they're my one of my favorite pairs of jeans. I think it's because they're like more of a jeggy material but they held up great and I love them and they're so comfortable. The only thing is they're like more mid-rise waist, not high-rise. So if I wear a cropped shirt, my stomach's more likely to show. But sometimes I just like how like those look on me and they're a little more flattering. Just because the knee holes, my black ones, are like really... They sometimes just make, like, make it look like I'm wearing boyfriend jeans and I'm not. So I wanted to take those instead. And then... I have this star shirt. Um, I've worn it like a thousand times. It's like my favorite shirt in my closet. I wore it 2018, like New Year's Eve. So like whatever it was, 2017 becoming 2018. And then the last thing I have to bring is this cute bodysuit that I got yesterday from Brandy Melville at the mall. And I thought this would be cute with like my denim jacket and black jeans. So of course I have like my beauty stuff and then the one other thing that I'm going to bring um, is just my light North Face coat just in case it is kind of hot and I don't want to wear the huge bulky ski jacket. So then I brought socks, underwear, all that kind of stuff um, but that's not really like interesting. So, so then on to beauty like the things that I'm going to bring. I'm not bringing a lot. I'm trying to bring as little as possible but sometimes I have a problem with overpacking. 
So I'm bringing this thing. I've literally had this for like ever. And I just have like my acne medication, um, like topical gels, toothpaste, toothbrush, my glasses. Um, I think I have like some lotions. Yeah, just like my Clinique lotion, like deodorant, um, little hair ties, which I like to use because sometimes I like to braid my hair, some dry shampoo, um, and that kind of stuff. And then I have my straightener, which I take everywhere with me, and I love the straightener. It's the um, Baby Bliss Na Nano Titanium um, straightener. It's honestly great. I bought the really thin one, and I kind of wish I would have gotten the bigger one just because my hair is so thick. But I love this and it works amazing. And then I have just this makeup bag full of um, just my makeup. I tried to leave a lot at home because I didn't need to take a ton of bronzers, blushes, and highlighters whenever I have like this Urban Decay palette. And it literally has everything I need. So I'm going to skate. Like I'm not going to fashion week and then I have my makeup wipes from Neutrogena I probably should buy some more but I didn't but there's like grocery stores and stuff like that in Colorado so if I really need them lastly I'm going to take my Monet um, conditioner and shampoo I love these two products they're both for volume and that's all that I'm taking beauty wise I know it seems like a lot but for me it's not that much so that is all for the things that I'm packing um, the last thing that I have is just this cute beanie I got in New York City and I realized it was sitting on my floor and I had forgot to film it. So that is all for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching and this gave you guys a little bit of insight into what you should pack if you're going on a trip. Hopefully it was helpful. Um, make sure to like and comment on this video and subscribe below and I will see you guys in my next video.